Okay, I think that's it. I think we're ready. I think we're going. That's it. We'll load it up. There, there you go. It's on the it's in the stream manager, which means we're live. Hello there, Team Boy here, and welcome to Alien Isolation. Now, um, yeah, I figured I'd stream this. It's, it's eight o'clock. I wanted something to stream, and I thought, you know what, Alien Isolation. Let's reinstall that. Let's give. We're not played this in a while. Uh, let's give it another go. We're going to be loading it. We're, there's only one difficulty that we can be playing it on, and that's going to be Nightmare Difficulty. It is called Nightmare Difficulty, I believe. Uh, yeah, it's been a while since... Uh, let's see if I can't move the microphone a little bit, because it's... it's, it's it kind of causes a bit of a reflection, but let's see how that works. If I move up there, it's not going to... If I move, move around, it's not going to cause, like, a shadow. See what happens? Alright, it'll be fine, it'll be fine. Right. Um, what have we got? Play game, uh, Alien Isolation, start game, uh, that's, it, d it doesn't matter. Uh, playing the game with noise detection allows to connect sensor, I mean, I'll play it, but I don't, I don't, right, Nightmare, there we go, the ultimate test of survival, yeah. Nightmare is the ultimate level of difficulty, the greatest test of survival skill. Warning, for experienced survival experts, only survivor achievement can still be unlocked, uh, Wait, oh, oh, Survivor Achievement can still be unlocked in Hard or Nightmare. Okay, alright, well, we'll do this. Excuse me, we'll do this. Uh, do you really want to start a new game? Yes, uh, that's fine. Um, uh, yeah, it's been a while since I played this. This should be fun. I don't know if, um, I, I don't know if... Oh, it won't. No, no, it won't. This won't pick up my microphone because it's not, it's not ready, it's not connected to, like, the controller or anything like that. Right, okay, it won't matter. It won't matter. Um... Because the game won't detect the microphone. Oh god, I just realised that. Right, hang on, let me try. Let me start again. I just realised I, sk I skipped the cutscene, even though it does. I think. Hang on, hang on. I mean, let me back out, restart. I forgot that I was uh, skipping things. So let's go. Quit to main menu. Let's start all that again. And this time we will actually start. Oh my goodness. All right. Uh, let's try it again, shall we? Uh, I'll, 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 I'll start the. Uh, I'll, 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 I'll put it on there, but it won't do anything. Yeah, let's go. Boom. Ooh, the atmosphere, the atmospheric, the, the atmosphericness. I actually haven't played this on the Series X yet. This should be fun. We'll see, we'll see how long it takes for us to uh, get through the first few alien segments, shall we? Sega presents in association with 20th Century Fox. Final oh. report of the commercial starship Nostromo. Oh. Third officer reporting. Hopefully this doesn't break the microphone, me whispering like this. The other members of the crew. Kane. Lambert. Parker. Brett. Ash. And Captain Dallas. Are dead. Makes me want to uh, watch the first alien. Makes me want to Cargo watch Alien again. Ship destroyed. I should reach the frontier in about six weeks. With a little luck, the network will pick me up. This is Ripley. Last survivor of the Nostromo. Signing off. Ooh, alien isolation. I wasn't a particular fan of the first alien. It was a bit too slow for me. Uh, I'd have to, I'd have to watch it again to see if, uh, I don't know, maybe I was just younger at the time, and, and see if I can admit, like, retain, re like, retain the attention. Um, but, you know, a Aliens was much more my speed. Ripley. Here we go. Amanda Ripley. The prodigy. I'm Samuels. I work for the company. Good day, sir. It's about your mother. We think we may have found her, Amanda. Do tell. A commercial vessel, the Anisadora, has recovered what we believe to be the flight recorder unit of the Nostromo. Okay. Where? Zeta Reticula. What did it tell you? We don't know. The unit was taken to Sevastopol Station. It's... Proprietorial material, so the company wants it to be collected as soon as possible. Back into hell again, I see. How you doing, Harry? How's uh, how's Hogwarts? I know what it is. 
I saw, I saw you. I saw you casting your spells and shit in, in, in there. So how you doing? There's a courier ship called the Torrens heading out that way in two days. We're going to travel out. We. Oui. Me and another exec. And you, if you're willing. No. Look, Ripley. It was good. No one called me transphobic, thank God. Well, I'm glad to hear that. I was, I, I was going to ask you that actually. Did anyone jump in? But uh, no, good to hear it's quiet. I know why you're working in the region where she went missing. Do you now? You're still looking, aren't you? How dare you! You don't I've know been me. Clear to offer you a place on the Torrance if you want to come along. Only my friend Ryan jumped Maybe. in. Yeah. There'll be some closure for you. How about we close this conversation? Uh, how, how, how have you and good guy Ryan been? Uh, shooting the, uh, shooting the you're a wizard Harry joke. Oh. Oh, oh right, uh, oh, right, okay, so he, what, he, he jumped into your chat and did the you're a wizard Harry joke. Yeah, I did, pretty sure I did that joke in either the Discord or on Twitter, I can't remember. Uh, we're good. Yeah, yeah. alright, good to wear it. We have teleported aboard, 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 aboard the Nostromo. Oh yes, 60 FPS. Oh yes, that's good. That's good. I'll get a PC eventually, alright? Stop mocking me. Let's go. Explore the torrents. Yeah, mate, alright. Um... I, it, it was either it was either gonna be this or some not going hardcore mode. Uh, I'm about to stream Pokemon Brilliant Diamond. Brilliant, dare I say? Get dressed. Uh, you know, I don't think that's that's completely necessary. Um, uh, yeah, I've never played any of the Pokemon games. Um, I'm, well, okay, right, so I can crouch. I can take a shower. Yeah, mate. Cool. Um. This will, this will be a good way to pass the time. Yeah, I've never played any of the uh, Pokemon games. I played Digimon on the DS one time. I can't remember what like the subtitle of the game was called, but I'd, I'd just Digimon, I suppose. Um, that was fun. Uh, I feel like I should get into the Pokemon games, but I need a DS first, or, or at least or at least to sort myself an emulator out. Uh, before that, um, I need to get myself like I, I want to get myself a proper PC uh, sorted so that I can. Uh, well, so I'm not just doing everything off this laptop. I feel like I might keep the laptop for rendering, uh, so that I could that way I can multitask. You know, like I could record or game on the PC, and then I can render in the background on the uh, on the laptop. Uh, that would always be good. Uh, I'm buying all the Pokemon games on 3DS eShop. Uh, I, uh, I'm buying all the game. I'm, I'm buying all the Pokemon games on 3DS eShop. I can before the 3D, 3DS eShop closes. If it's an eShop, then doesn't it, once it closes, won't that revoke the licenses? Or, or it won't. It, you won't be able to keep the digital purchases because the licenses won't be recognised. Uh, surely that's how that would work. I, I would hope not, but be careful, man. Uh, get dressed. Cool. I'll switch that off just to sabotage the ship. All right. Take all. Yeah, I'm just gonna take all that. I'm not even gonna read what I pick up. I'm just gonna take it all. Nice. Uh, use registration parts. Let's save. Hell yeah. Boom. Yeah, mate. Oh god, it's always it's always good when you when you do that and you save right as you. Uh, oh, hang on, hang on. I feel like I missed something here. Nope. Why am I trying to use the mouse pad when I have a bloody mouse? There we go. Uh, Dunrox, good evening, good sir. Just wanted to swing by and wish you good luck. What? Thank you, thank you, Dunrox. Um, I, I don't know what else to call you, but I recognise you. Uh, have have a have a splendid day and thank you for the good luck. Um. Uh, thanks for thanks for swinging by, as you put it. Uh, no, you'll keep all digital games you've bought. You can re-download anything you bought. Games can still uh, you can re-download anything you bought. Games can still be updated from devs. Okay, all right. Uh, but just the eShop, but the place that you buy them from, um, the place that you buy them from is you can't buy them anymore. Okay, fair, fair enough. Fair enough. That's ideal, I suppose. Um, screw it. I will go and read all these. Just missed you. Verlaine, you want to look out for a navigational officer? I have a friend that's just lost his ship and he's looking for work. I can vouch for him. He's got good papers. Same old story. The megacorp, un uh, the megacorps un undercut him. Picked up all his, uh, picked up all his clients. Contracts are getting harder to come by for the smaller companies, and I'm thinking of getting out myself while I still have something to sell. 
Sounds like you're doing okay, though. Dropped by the docks and heard you just shipped out. Sevastopol Station, what a shithole. Still, I heard Wayland Yutani pay well. How dare you. Good luck to you. Even uh, if you can't beat them, right? Let's catch up when you get back. Blaine. Alright, good stuff. Thank you. You're welcome. Have a splendid day. Um, and I look forward to the next stream as well. Uh, where are we off to? Um, let's see. We, we did get dressed. Well, no, no one ever complained about extra layers, shall we? Nope. Alright. Uh, where, right, where are we off to now? I mean, you know, I, I don't know about you guys, but I like the cold, so I don't mind. No. Alright. I can't sprint, but I can crouch, weirdly enough. So, off we go. Is this... I forget what your name is. Oh, that's Samuels. Never mind. It's not what I thought it was. I thought it was the, uh... I, I can't remember her name, but it's a girl. Ah, Ripley. Samuels. Yes. Did you wake up early? Well, I don't really need as much sleep as the rest of you. He's a gamer at heart. I was just inspecting the Torrens facilities. A well-maintained ship. I realize it's a very similar model to... The Nostromo. Yes. M-Class. A later pattern, but close in spec. I've worked engineering jobs on ships like this. Of course. It's Taylor. 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 Oh! Uh, Dunrocks followed. Oh, thank you. I didn't uh, spot that until a moment ago. Thank That's you for the follow, Dunrocks. I'll go check on her. Um... I feel like I should get I should get some audible sound alerts or something. I mean, I don't I, I don't have any, so I just have to uh, I, I just have to keep an eye out for that. Um, thank you for the follow. I didn't spot that. Um, I just I, I, I just looked up I looked up to see the chat and then I glanced upwards and then just saw that the follow account had gone up from forty seven. I was like, oh, sorry, I missed that. Uh, yes, thank you for the follow. I don't think you're even still here, but oh well. Let's go. I can press I can push buttons here. I've never seen this. Do, do I do I want to move out the way? Oh, okay. I hope you were done with that, Samuels. Track laser scan ultrasound CT scanner, everything a TV needs to watch Mad Max Fury Road. Um, off we go. Right, is there, is there anything over? Here? I mean, I feel like I just want to go around and just look at stuff now. I mean. We got the Torrens, the MSV-7760, plus 4 volts, minus 2 volts, neg, plus 1 volts, neg, sure, I don't know what to make of all those, output high, I equals CN, alright, uh, sure, what have we got up here, alright, I, I don't really know what to make of any of this, it's been a while, you know, since I've just Hi, Samuels. That was, a, that was like a comfy coat, by the way. I never really paid attention to that, but I like that coat. Can I can I have it? Are these did these did these come with the uh, uh did these come with the scratch marks on this thing? Samuels, where do all of these scratch? Why is your coat torn up? Where have you been? We're in space. Where could these marks possibly come from? Have you been having a fight with Taylor? Did she win? Samuels, it's okay. Alright. It's alright. I don't know what's alright, but it's alright. Whatever it is. Uh. What I'm up to now. Right. We could go there. No, we can't. Uh, we can go over here. Why, thank you. Now for the main event, it would seem. Right, well. Oh no, that's just that's just the crackling of electricity. That's nothing in particular. Taylor, how goes you? Taylor, good morning. Ripley, it's certainly not good. I very much doubt it's morning how either. How dare you? Of course it's good. Sorry. It is splendiful. I feel like death. I don't know how you people put up with hypersleep regularly. You reckon you death sleep. feels like death? I don't do long haul very often. Like the the, the Grim Reaper, I mean. Execs don't travel further than the coffee machine. I'm surprised Wayland Yutani felt the need to send legal at all. The loss of the Nostromo and its cargo cost the company a lot of money. It's important we find out what happened. If I can close the case with a conclusive accident report, it'll look great with my superiors. I'm sorry. That was insensitive. I realize your mother has been missing for 15 years and, and you... It's okay. We'll both get what we want, right? Uh, have you seen Samuels? He's probably been up for hours. Yeah. Anyway, 
Um, yeah, I'll do that at some point. Don't mind me. Um, yeah, what I mean, like, so, like, the Grim Reaper, does he feel like death? Maybe that's why he, like, maybe that's why he wears the hood, because he just looks like shit, so he wants to hide his face from everybody. And he, he doesn't actually, like, he collects the souls and transports them to hell or purgatory? I don't know, actually, what the lore is there. Um, but, you know, he transports the souls of the dead to the underworld, or does whatever he does, um... That's just his job. He doesn't actually. He doesn't actually like hate people or want to kill people or anything like that. He just he hides his face because he just feels like death all the time, and he's just. You know what I mean? Should we just give death a hug next time we see him? Right. Uh, L M Link. I forgot. Personal reply. Nostromo incident. Two N Taylor. R E uh, reply. Nostromo. Uh, Nostromo incident. Wayland Utani file. Uh, Wayland Utani file. Number DS9398476. Hey Taylor, I got your case request. It may take me a while to dig out the files and the accident happened before my time at the company, so I'm a bit fuzzy on the details. In 2122, the Wayland Utani cargo vessel, the, USC, the USCSS uh, Nostromo, went missing. No trace was found of its cargo or crew. Apart from my new science officer, the rest of the crew had worked together before. Seven in all. Dallas, uh, Dallas, uh, uh, we've got Captain Dallas, Science Officer Ash, Executive Officer Kane, or is it Kane? Uh, Warrant Officer Ripley, Navigation Officer Lambert, Chief Engineer Parker, and Engineer Technician Brett. Um, oh yes, Bilbo Baggins himself. I can't remember who's who. Wayland Utani lost a lot. Which one of them is John Hurt? It's Kane, isn't it? I don't know. Ah, John Hurt. Will and Jutani lost a lot of money from it, and it's a bit of a black mark in the history. Get the impression they don't like to mention it. Anyway, I'll try and file the f I'll try I'll try and find the files later. Clarify some of the points. If you want help, I can if you want I can help you go through them. Maybe some of your luck will rub off on me. I hear upstairs have an eye on you for something big. Saul. 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 I'm gonna call him Saul. I won't, I'll call him Saul. Right, I believe that's everything. We were taking up enough of... Wait a second, there was something else on this computer, wasn't there, that I missed? <laughs> Torrens Manifest. Name MSV-7760 Torrens. M-Class Starship. Captain Verlaine, Diane. Navigator slash com officer, Connor William. Owner, Verlaine, Diane. Contractor, Will and Yutani. Outbound and return transportation for Wayland Utani retrieval team to Sevastopol, uh, Sevastopol Station. Uh, team consists of three uh, Wayland Utani employees: Samuels C. Ripley, uh, oh, Samuels C. Ripley A. Tamanda. Uh, uh, Ripley A. Taylor N. Passengers: Samuels Christ. Oh, passengers. Samuels, Christopher, Ripley, Amanda, Taylor, uh, Christopher Samuels, Amanda Taylor, Christopher Samuels, Amanda Ripley, and Nina Taylor. Okay, do. All right, we're back. We're, we're, we're back in. All right. Number of decks, two. Number of crew, two. Interstellar communications antenna. Long haul hypersleep chamber. Commercial passenger slash cargo ship retrofitted from a tow rig. Retains operational heavy duty tow umbilical. Good to know. All right. So, what 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 we're looking at now? Where, where are we off to? What we're looking forward to? Diane Verlaine. Hope you all had a restful journey. I did indeed. Is in very good order for an old M class captain. She was a wreck when I bought her. Took a few years and a lot of contracts to refit. She pays for herself now. I congratulate you. Approaching Sevastopol Station. Are we docking? I believe your contact is Marshal Waits, is that right? I'll hail Sevastopol and arrange boarding with him. Good. Let's get this done. Don't worry, Miss Taylor. Routine. In and out. Connor, how are we doing? RCMG loaded and calibrated. Approach vector locked. Prep comms so I can say hello. Channel open, Captain. Does everyone have their briefing documents? You can watch the approach on the monitors. I think I should retrieve my briefing document. Let us take a gander, shall we? What we got? Here it is. Collect briefing file. Allow us to begin. Oh, look at us go. 
Can we see it? Switch to monitors. Sevastopol Station. Is that damage? It looks like damage. How can you see that from here? Punch up 74, tight angle. Looks like the dry dock bay is screwed. Does it? I don't know. Where? Torrens into that. This is a commercial vessel Torrens out of St. Clair, registration number MSV7760, calling Sebastopol traffic control. We're carrying three passengers on a whaler. Yutani Bond, you're holding the Nostromo flight recorder unit. We request immediate permission to transfer the passengers port side over. <laughs> Marshall? Mar Marshall, this is the Torrent. Say again. I think he was saying, uh, please board. We have food. Uh, we, we have, we're having a feast. Celebratory feast. Up, so our fitted Samuel suit with a radio booster. I can only keep the Torrens in transit for 24 hours. You'll have heard from us by then. Safe trip. Alrighty then. What's the worst that can happen? We stand by. My contract doesn't cover bloody spacewalks. Oh, it does it's now. The only option, and it's perfectly safe if you do what I tell you. Yeah, what's the worst that can happen? We 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 slip and dangle and, and just drift off into space until we run out of oxygen. You might want to slow down your breathing, Taylor. You, you might run out. Affirmative. Taylor, get ready to jump for it. What the fuck happened here? My God, Ripley. You're doing good, Taylor. Now that looks like damage. Taylor, slow down the breathing, you can run out. Well, it would appear that everything that could have gone wrong went wrong. Taylor, respond, anybody! Alrighty then, it would appear that we are going solo. I only noticed this, but the game selectively chooses when the sound doesn't exist in space. There we go. We're in. It's like it's like wait. Okay, so we. It's like wait. So there's sound for when we smack into the side of the station, but there's not sound for when the doors open. It's like well, I mean, obviously for that part, they're they're going for the they're going for the atmosphere because you know there's no sound in space. But it's like well, commit to it then. Don't have sound in space. For one scene and then not have sounding space for another. So, well, no, come on, stick to it. Would have been better if we actually just smacked into it and then there was just no noise. But, I mean, you know, one or the other. Doesn't matter which one, but oh. Alright, no, those are just uh, flecks of dust. I thought, those, I thought those were stars. I was like, why can I see stars? Alright. Find help. Right, well, there you go. Let's get out of the suit, get rid of these extra layers. Oh yes, and now let's see what we've got waiting for us. Um, now, in Aliens vs Predator, the where am I going? This way. In Aliens vs Predator, the nightmare difficulty is one life, so like you have to you restart the entire mission if you die. Uh, I was initially under the impression that that was how it would work for this game. Like if you get if you walk around the corner and the alien just decides to say hi, you have to play the entire game again. That's not how it works. Hang on. Uh, yeah, that, that's not how it works, and you, uh, wait, flex answer, yeah, uh, you, you, you do, in fact, uh, save, Sa saves do work. Excuse me, alright, let's go this way, why not, see what, see what we've got, see what we're looking at. Alright, so there's no loot about, let's go and get... Yet indeed. We can go that way, but I want to see if there's any 
Oh, okay, it doesn't appear that there is. No loot. Off we go. There's only so many times that we can crawl through a vent safely in this game. Oh, yes. I remember I had my fair share of frights when I was younger playing this game. And I was t I would have been 12 when this game came out. It was 2013, wasn't it? Wait, hang on, let me, let me look this up. Hang on, wait. Alien... Iso... No. Solation, no. Iso... Isolation? Isolation release date. Uh... Oh, 2014. 6th of October, 2014. So, uh, I would have been 13 when that came out. Um, I want to say that I probably got my hands on it about a year after, uh, it came out. So, 2015, uh... Oh yeah, because I think I got the I think I got this I think I got my first Xbox One in 2015, and I don't think I had it straight away. I want to say, I want I want to say I want to say late 2015. I want to say late 2015. I probably got my hands on this game, so I would have been, I would have been 14 going on 15 when I first when I first got this. Um, so oh my goodness, I'm nearly 22 22 in a month. So oh buddy boy. Been a long, been a long, been a long time. I've not, I've not played. It's not that I've not played it since I was like 15. I've played it since then, but not. I've not played it in a few years. Uh, let's go. What, what we're we looking at? What have we got? Folder corrupted. All right, we've got shared decommissioning to engineering team. Reply decommissioning. So, boys and girls, you probably heard the whispers about Sevastopol by now, and I can confirm it's official. Sevastopol is being decommissioned. I will go over with each of you what this means in regards to your contracts and next placement, but for now we still have a job to do. The suits want this done with a skeleton crew, which means we'll, be, we'll only be getting a few outside contractors to help, but it does mean overtime. I recommend taking what you can while it's available. I should point out that the decommission does not mean lucky dip. Everything here has to be accounted for and I will personally escort anyone found, them, found helping themselves to equipment to martial weights. Chief. Alright, folder corrupted. There you go. Brilliant. So, you can't just play take a... A, a, a conductor or something like that off a wall, and it's yours. Oh dear! Oh, oh right, well, that was a short let's play, wasn't it? Ow! I'd appreciate a med kit because that's just we've we've had a bit of a slide. Alrighty then. So we've got. God damn. Yeah. This will help. Yeah. So we've we've just slid all the way down there. I don't think we have a uh, we have a flare which I can use. Nice. So. Oh, invisible wall. Oh god, damn it, I can't even pick that back up. Really? Really? Can I not pick that back up? God damn it. I don't know if enemies uh, get distracted by those. I never really mess with flares in this game. Uh. Yeah, no, and it's the same. It's the same with Subnautica as well. And I mentioned that earlier. I just, I just kind of, I've got the inventory up there for a moment. I never really bothered with flares. Didn't really have enough of a utility from what I could tell, especially when compared with other stuff. So I just kind of went with it. Just kind of went with that other stuff. Right. Uh, doesn't appear to be any loot or anything that we're missing out on there. So let's wait. Was well, there anything over? Ah, but there's probably something over there, though, isn't there? Right, hang on. Come on. Ha! I can sprint. Yeah, mate. Won't be doing much of it, but we'll be doing some of it. Oh, yes. You really do run slow in this, don't you? Mate, it's... isn't it... isn't it... isn't it... it, it really says a lot about how sprinting essentially gets you killed, like, 90% of the time. But when the alien sees you, you still sprint. You still run. It's not... It, you can't escape the alien by running, no matter what. Unless there's like some kind of bug or something that you, you're able to exploit, but wait. Lower luggage ramp, hell yeah. Wait. Okay, right. It's like, you know, running will attract the alien to you. And running does not get you away from the alien. It, it doesn't. Um, but. Oh, speaking of the alien. Oh, it stopped. The noise stopped. I don't know if you could. I don't know if you could hear it then, but the alien, you could hear something crawling through the vent. That was that. That that was it. That was the alien. Obviously, we don't know that yet at this point in the game, and it doesn't know we're here, and it's not after us, but there it is. There was the alien. Alright, what's going on here? Let me just, just cycle through a few notifications. Yeah, mate? Hell yeah. Um, 
Oh. Hello? I feel like we'll have to uh, be a bit louder with that, but you know. It's a model of Sevastopol Station. Yeah. Uh, was I, I feel like I was in the middle of saying something. I've, I was in the middle of something and then I just kind of forgot. Wait, we have to come back in here in a minute. Pass go required. Alright, we'll get that in a second. That's where we get the medkit blueprint, I believe. If I remember correctly. Oh yes, update the map. Come on, do it. Update the map. Use these terminals to update your map with unexplored areas. Yeah, mate. And we open up the map. Uh, the game's not paused while we're here, is it? Archive logs. Ooh. Ooh. Uh, oh my goodness. Uh, I did not real. Uh, this just shows that I didn't. I never. I, I, I never. Uh, archive. Is this all the stuff that I've unlocked throughout the game? Like this isn't. This this is stuff. This is stuff that's not. Oh, these are stuff that I haven't found. I never knew this page was here. Personal log, A fielding, missing persons, highlight entry, last known location, freight shipping, ID code eight eight four one. I don't know if this is supposed to mean like. Uh, I don't know if we find. I know we find some of these by doing things like if you find tags and stuff about the place. Okay, all right. I I never looked at that area. I guess that just shows that I just never explore things, and I don't have a map just yet. Weirdly enough, so. Excuse me. All right. What have we got? Low power. Uh, aha. I remember you. Uh, oh yeah. Um, it's sprinting no matter what. It attracts alien to you, and you cannot escape the alien by running. It will catch you. It will. It. It. It will look for you. It will find you, and it will kill you. Um, but you, you, every time the alien, if you turn around the corner and the alien just looks at you, you will run. You won't just stand there and take it. Um, it's, it's, always, it's always interesting how the game gets you like that. All right. Uh, here we go. Yeah, so so the game has remembered previous logs that we've unlocked. Uh, moved our stash. Langley, if you are looking for our stash, I've moved it. You left it right out in the open where anyone could have taken it. Jesus, do you know what I had to do to get it? I've hidden it in one of the storerooms. You should be able to find it. The code is 0340. Don't worry, no one goes down to the terminal anymore. Not after what happened. Also, we're out of meds and low on water, so you're going to need to get some. It's your turn. Maybe it'll teach you to take care of our stuff in the future. Anna. Alright. We've got shared goodbye from Siegson. Public notice. The decommissioning of Sebastopol Station. We've had a long journey together, but sadly it's coming to an end. Seeks and Corp would like to take this op would like to take this opportunity to thank all of you who worked and lived at Sevastopol over the years, and hopes that Seekson has helped to make it a productive and rewarding environment. Our investment and belief in the station has never wavered. We are assured that Seekson's Apollo Central AI and Working Joe Androids will be there to serve Sevastopol until the last rivet is removed. We wish you all the very best for the future. After all, Sevastopol isn't just a station. It's people, and you cannot decommission people, so goddamn. Seekson Corp. I mean, they'll find a way. Audio, kill the power. Harris, Turner, get back here. Wait, hang on. Harris, Turner, there we go. Get back here now. We have a track somewhere in engineering. Lock the terminal down, kill the power, and don't forget your reports. Make them thorough. We're going to need our paperwork to be bulletproof when this shit's over. Wait's up. Hell yeah. Uh... Uh, we have a track somewhere in engineering. Uh, make, make the reports. Okay. Power junction D13 departures. Restore powers to departure. Restore power to departure. I'd say let's make an effort for that. I'd say let's do it. All right. Let's go. There we go. Oh. Where are you guys running to? Oh, that's suspicious. All right. Let's get here, it's 0340 for the password, so let's save and get our way over to that door so we can get the medkit blueprint because oh boy we're gonna need it. Can I I cannot I thought I heard something in the vent. I know that the alien can't like show up until a little bit later, but still. Let's go. Uh, in fact actually I'm gonna I'm gonna let the alien show up for for at the uh, as far as I can tell, the earliest point it can possibly show up. And that's supposed to be, like, earlier than you are meant to encounter it. Like, the game the game tries to essentially scare you off into an elevator, and the idea is that you're being hunted by the alien. Um, and then, but if you wait long enough, the alien actually does show up and, and, and kill you. 
So I will, I will, I won't let it kill me. I will try and get the, well, I mean, I'll try not to let it kill me anyway. I'll, I'll get in the elevator just in time, but it does actually show up. Medkit V1. Oh, yes. Blueprint collected. Do we found a blueprint? Yeah, mate, can I, I can't do that just yet, but what I will do is you. Boom. So what do I actually need now? I need uh, SCI injector and bonding agent. Oh, boy, SCI injectors. I remember those things. Right, where are we off to? We're going up here, I believe. Looks like it. It's the only door that's open. Ah, uh, yes. Doors being slow to open when you kind of need them to hurry the fuck up. Oh, that's not the crouch button. There we go. Tomorrow. Uh, wait. Tomorrow, together, no future. Left to rot. I think it's pronounced left for dead, but I can't play it anymore. I mean, it's not, it's not, I can't buy it in the Xbox store. So, I mean, unless I get a, a physical copy, it ain't happening. Um, all right. Wait, come on, let's, 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 let's get up here. Let's, let's signal the, no, not the Nostromo, the, uh, the, tor the Torrens. Torrens. Help. We're, we're, we're dying in here! I'm here. I'm right here. We're lame. Contact the torrents. Yeah, I never understood this. If they're, if they're looking, if they're using that light to see into this window, how is it that they can't see us? Like, what was even the point? If, if the torrents isn't supposed to be able to help us because they can't see us or they can't contact us or we can't contact them or anything like that, why bother having it? so that they fly past and can clearly see you without uh if the whole if the objective is to basically keep them out of the game because we're isolated you know it's alien isolation we're stuck here on the station without any help why have that happen you know uh anyway right let's oh god i remember the first time i streamed this game on the old channel um was it even the first stream i can't remember but uh I was stuck in this segment for like half an hour or something because I was really tired uh, and I just I, I was not paying attention and it turns out that the way to progress was literally me just getting an event that was on the floor. Um, I remember that. That was oh, those were fun times. wasn't fun at the time, but it was a fun time. No fun. Click. Off we go. Yeah, mate. Awesome. Bonk. Yeah, mate. We're sorted. Okay, now right, that's, that's the crackling of electricity in the game. That's not my audio. Sick. Good to know. Oh, oh. Here we go. This thing is just opened up. Let's go in here. Look in here. Look in here. Stirred something rattling about in here. That's not good. But we'll live. Yeah, it's that. You literally just go in here like that, and that, that thing was there the entire time. I'd been in this area like ages, and I just could not figure my way about. Access terminal, Sevasta link, and an LM link product. Pulling the plug. Zoe, I'm sorry, but I won't need you to come in next week. As you know, the store's been in trouble for some time now, and I couldn't hold off the creditors any longer. There's just no one coming to Sevastopol anymore. It's not just us either. It sounds like the whole station is in the red, and they are pulling the plug. Going to sell it off for scrap. Uh, going to sell it off for scrap, I guess. I was speaking to one of the engineers, and he reckons they'll announce it soon. I'm telling you this so you don't stick around looking for another job. Sevastopol's finished. Time to move on. Harper. Uh, shared. Wait, that was yeah, that was the end of that, right? Shared to all spaceflight employees. To all spaceflight terminal employees, in the interest of public safety and the prevention of panic, it must be made clear to all potential passengers that there are currently no scheduled flights leaving Sevastopol, nor ships available. The Colonial Marshals are investigating problems on station and will update accordingly. From the Office of Marshal Waits. Alright, we've got what is Apollo? What is Apollo? Apollo is the central AI that monitors and provides guidance for all the Sikhs and working Joes on Sevastopol. Apollo also oversees all communications on the station. So wherever you are, you know you're in safe hands. Season. Uh, Sikhson. Tomorrow. Together. Well, there's a central AI that oversee that basically controls all communications in and around the station. And also controls the, uh, the, the working Joe androids. Yes. I see this as an absolute win. Alright, let me save. 
because we can. Ne there's never a point. There's never not a point to save. There, there, there's never a time where saving is unwise, unless there's an alien right behind you, which happens more times than you'd like. There we go. Speaking of an alien being right behind you, what's that behind me? <gasps> right. We 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 are in event. If an alien was to show up right now, we couldn't we couldn't even run even if. You know, lights don't tend to just move for no reason. If an alien was to find its way, oh wow, wow they actually do move like when you move through them like that. Sick. Uh, climb out. Off we go. Um, yeah, if the alien was to find us in one of those vents, we couldn't run, and even if we could, we wouldn't escape it. Oh yes. Ah, uh, still life. This whole damn place is falling apart. Falling apart? I don't know what you mean. Let's go. Come on, do you think? There you go. That was the most anticlimactic and uneventful point of this game so far. I didn't mean for that to happen. Medkit, just no. Can I? Can I? Can I get this thing out of my hand, please? I don't really want to just walk around with it in my hand. I can hear the alien walking around in the vents around me. That's always fun. You know, when the game, when the alien actually becomes, uh, we don't have to worry about that for the time being because the alien isn't actually active yet. That's just atmospheric, you know, ooh, there's an alien, oh, what's that that you can hear in the vents? Dun dun dun, you know? That as well, that's a thing. Um, so, we've got baggage claim, good to know. Um, what was I saying? Yeah, uh, Oswald, hold me. Right, um, oh yeah, yeah, it's like the alien isn't actually active yet, it can't kill us. It's not real. It can't hurt us. Um, but once it actually once it actually does become active, and it can drop out of a vent anywhere, and, and just attack us, that's when we have to be very uh, careful. Um, that, that's, when, that, that's when we actually have to worry when we hear something in the vents, because that usually means it's moving to a location. That location, more times than, than we would like, is usually within eyesight of us. It's usually right above us. Oh yes. Body bags all over the place. Some of them probably fall. The exit up ahead. It would appear to be so. We need a maintenance jack. Ah uh, yes. The trusty maintenance jack. Uh, I always I always find find the like removing the maintenance jacks to be really satisfying. I don't know why. Um I, 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 I don't know why I just I just find them to be satisfying, it's weird. Excuse me. Right. Right. Let's go this way. I, I really wish I could just, like, throw away this flare. I don't want to activate it, but I don't want to just walk around with it in my hand the entire time, you know? That's, that's the way of the world, isn't it? Right, let's get those lights on. Sort ourselves out. Yeah, mate. Sure. Good stuff. Yeah, mate. And we're going. We're alive. What? Oh, yeah, that's a thing that we can do. I forgot about that. Yeah, mate. No, nope, that's not the button. Alright, screw it. We're going this way. Alright, no no loot for us to collect? Uh, of course not. Good to know. Just gotta keep an eye out, as you do. Right. Well, what's, what's the plan here? Where are we going? You know, that way? I mean, for the time being, we're okay to walk under vents like this, but, uh... I used to, me and my mate used to do this in college, um, cause we were, we were, like, we were both autistic, do you know what I mean? We were, we were, we didn't care that anybody was watching and could see us being idiots, but we used to always, like, uh, we'd walk into a room, uh, we'd see each other, and then, um, as, uh, as we'd go to walk up, uh, we, like, one of us would just point out that they just walked under a vent or something, it was, oh, great, good times, good times. Um, right, what? Where are we going? Wait, I don't have the torch yet, but... Right, hang on. Am I, am I missing something right now? There's supposed to be, I'm supposed to be able to get in one of these rooms. Because there's the mate, the mate is Jack's in there, isn't it? So, wait. Okay. Okay, right, apparently it's not in there then, is it? Have I gone the wrong way entirely? Have I, have I done that? Yeah, we don't have to worry about the vents just yet, but... Oh boy, we're going we're to have to worry about the vents at some point. We. Are we not going this way? 
Is there actually... Oh, wait. Were we supposed to activate the power and then come in and hit? Probably. That's probably exactly what's supposed to happen. Um, there, I'm completely environmentally unaware of my surroundings. Absolutely nothing just happened. There is no safety hazard, i.e. shattered glass on the floor. Don't know what you mean. What is this thing? How long does this thing last? I, I, I like how... I like how I'm talking about how the uh, well the aliens not active yet, and I'm just go I'm just literally broadcasting my position. It's very good that the aliens not active yet because I'm just here. Can I get rid of this? Oh my god, I can actually do that. Wouldn't it be cool if you could like deny uh, if you could like scare an alien off from a vent or something like that by doing that? Like you can hear it moving through the vents, and then you just throw a flare up there, and then you just hear a, a screech, and it goes away. That'd be sick. But I don't think that's I don't think that you can actually do that. Uh, right, so that's, yeah, that's where we go. Is there any, not miss any loot or anything in the area? It would appear not. Good to know, let's be gone. Yeah, mate. Off we go. Off we go. Why do I feel like I can hear singing? Is it amnesia? What's going on? Alright, what, what's... Oh, this is a blood trail. Alright. Hmm, I wonder what... I wonder how this guy died. He doesn't look wounded. I mean, there's blood all over the place. Well, what I mean is like... Did he get chest bursted or... Ugh. I think I need this more than you do. Maybe. Alright. Like he doesn't look injured or anything, you know. So he's got no, there's no, no bullet hole. He doesn't, there's no. Yeah, there's no, there's no injury here. He's, he's faked. He's faked. He's faked it. Rulo, I want to make a complaint to the, the highest authority. Okay. My name is Zachary Watson. That's Watson. You get that? My complaint is this: fucking marshals. They should be protecting us. It's their job. Something's on this station with us and no one knows what it is. No one fucking knows. They put braces on the doors. Locked down. You know, like to keep something out. I'm fucking terrified, man. I'm fucking... It does indeed. There is a creature on this station, and nobody knows what it is. You could say it is alien. Here we go. Remove brace. Let's go. Yeah, I, I don't know. I just always found these mini games uh, <laughs> satisfying. And there you go. The door opens. I, I, I don't know. I, I just, just, just gets me. Just gets me. I just like doing them. I just, why did that move? Why, why did that move? Alright, anyway. Remove brace. Hell yeah. Yeah, mate. Solid. Open sesame. Off you got. We have... Is there anything over here? We've got another recorder. Interview subject. Heist. Did I say that right? Heist? Look, if you can't even tell me your name, we're gonna be here a hell of a long time. I just want to know about your boss. He's got you all into a lot of trouble. Someone's gonna be accountable. I'm gonna make damn sure someone's accountable. No? Tough guy, huh? Turner, turn off the tape. Maybe our friend here is just shy. Maybe, maybe not. Uh, I'll, honestly, I do not have much to comment on there. Uh, well, right, so who's, what, what, what's in here? Any, any loot? Any more recorders? We have... What? What? Am I even supposed to be reading that upside down? I don't know. Maybe, I don't know. Anyway. No, I've got to try it again. Hang on. So we've got, uh, wait, wait, what? 
I can't be bothered. I can't be bothered. Right. Um. Right. One would almost think that there's an alien in here. Are you sure? Alright. Uh, hold hard. Oh, we'll be doing that. Oh, mate. Mate, ho holding your breath while in one of those those areas is... Oh, oh yes. Um, the only thing that's annoying about it is that even when the aliens left, it's like it's like it doesn't matter if you do the minigame correctly or if the alien saw you get in, go into the... the uh, oh, wait. Let's, oh, yeah. We've got a cutscene here. It doesn't matter if the alien saw you or if... Uh, you do the minigame correctly. Sometimes it just... Stay still. Okay, alright. Okay, okay. Uh, turn around. Come on! Alright, relax. No sudden movements, that kind of thing, you know. I'm Ripley. Where'd you come from? Ripley? Off station. A ship. There's no ships here! There are now. Well, <laughs> that's good news. Because things are not so good here. Something blue just now. Rocked this whole place. I saw it. Yeah, lost my team doing it. But lady, that's the least of our problems. Yeah? Yeah. Something's on this station. Something you wouldn't believe. What is it? Like what? A killer. You get it? Okay. A creature? I've heard of it. What's your name? Oh, yeah, the facial animations. Axel. I was boarding with two colleagues. EVA. We got separated by the blast. Can you help me find them? Why? Because you seem to know your way around. I mean, why? What's in it for me? A place on the ship. How did I know I can trust you? I need to find comms. I need to contact my ship. Me. So it's just seems like that kind of thing you're just gonna have to trust me, mate. This is your lucky day. Yes. You have a gun, I have this thing. Let's go, sweetheart. Seek some comms is in the system spire. It's quite a distance, but we can get to a transit through the freight area. Watch yourself. We can get into all sorts of trouble. Okay? All sorts. Well, all sorts of trouble shall be circumvented, good sir. Right. Was that you following me back there? I had to keep my distance. Can't take any chances. Yeah, sounds like a plan. I don't I don't remember being aware that anybody was following me. Um I I, I, I there's literally nothing here. Inquisitive type, eh? Stick close to me. Um. Hey, don't move. Uh, oh, okay, okay. We're not looking for trouble. Who are you? I'm John. This is Ringo. They're just some assholes. We haven't got um, time for this. Come on, Jenna. I have a name Let's tag on my shirt. Comms. Can you help us? We don't need their help. Don't tell them anything. Look, I've got the elevator working. Jenna, let's go, okay? I... I'm sorry. Good luck. Okay, alrighty. Uh... Uh... May, may the plot armor protect you too. Alright. Well, what's in here? I can't see my way around in here. Yeah, there's... I don't have any kind of light, so... Sure. Left. How was that to about? Rot. Why are you so damn aggressive? Everyone's running shit scared. Keeping to their own. Safer that way. Not entirely good, sir. Alright. I hope this ship of yours is the real McCoy. Um yes, it 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 is indeed. It it has thrusters. It can get us away. Save. Why not? Sounds like a plan. Let's get it done. All three progression lights go out. Well, we'll be making some progression of our own. Let me get the elevator. Excuse me. Why, such All a right. gentleman? Place is old. Needs a special touch. Are you sure it doesn't just require an access code? Let's go. Come up. Well, what are you waiting for? Hit the button. I was, but you know the prompt didn't show up. So uh, screw you. So uh, what are we keep the noise down. If you told me what the hell was going on right now, listen, sir. When we get to the ship, we can kick back, braid each other's hair, and chat all you want. What hair? When we get to my ship, I need to know what's going on right fucking now. Fine. Like I said, 
there's a killer. A killer? What does that even mean? I ain't seen it, but it's here. Picking us off one by one. What are you saying? A psycho? A person? No. Something else. I mean... A monster. He, 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 said, he said it was it, so... Uh, you don't usually call killers it, but, you know. Um, here we go. So... Yeah, yes, in, yes, indeed. There is a monster that nobody's ever seen before, and we shall be seeing quite a bit of it as we move forward. Uh, Shit, we need to move this way. Get down. This is bullshit, man. You should be looking for a way off. Are you crazy? There's no way off. Absolutely, forward, dude. How long? What if they come for us? Then we shoot the crap out of them. Now shut up. You're making me nervous. Go. What was what? What do you mean? Trouble. We'll have to go around them. False alarm. Follow me. What? What do you mean? Let's go. Come on. Off we go. Uh, hello. Come on. Can I move? Uh, can I? Oh. Right. Okay. Oops. Let's go. Friends of yours? Yeah, man. I've had run-ins with those guys before. They don't like strangers. Even nice guys like me. I'm shocked. I ain't pulling your chain, darling. You want to go and say hello? It's your funeral. Those guns aren't for show. Someone should be doing something. They are. It's called surviving. All right. No, has nobody tried to get out some kind of distress call and contact other ships? No. Turning on each other. The fear. It makes people crazy. I've noticed. I mean, yeah. Uh, I mean, you know, this kind of stress, uh, it has a knack for making people's hair fall out. What can I say? My butler's on holiday. Grab what you need. We don't know when you'll get another chance. Okay. Alright, what have we got? Collect ethanol. Down here for a week now, waiting for a ship. Waiting for you, I guess. Alright, yeah, mate. Well, you found me. Because I certainly didn't find you. We should take that flashlight over there. It is also a communicator. Make sure you're stocked up on batteries. Yeah, mate. Off we go. You know, that, that, that microphone always annoyed me. To flash it around. We don't want to get caught. Okay, Let's yeah. Go. Uh, that that that, fla that, that flashlight always always annoyed me because it was uh the the, the microphone piece is on uh, is on the opposite side to the one that mine's on. That on all, all my microphones have been on. So it always always. How much maybe go? Oh, that was annoying me a bit. Up we go. And now we have a flashlight. Yeah, mate. Now we can see things. Ah, we have flashlight batteries. I'll watch the vent. There's another vent right here somewhere. I marked it so I wouldn't forget it. Okay. All right. Uh, the flashlight on and off. Yeah, mate. No, oh, well, well, there's that. Axel, is this it? Hold on, I'm coming. No, I mean, well, this is the vent, but is there any more loot about? But we'll keep an eye out. I'm gonna go this way. I mean, again, the alien can't jump. I might as well sprint about, cause See, got it I found it. I don't know what you mean, mate. Uh, alright, cool. So, well, what have we got to look? Wait. Okay, right. So I can't go anywhere there. All right. You do that. Off we go. Yummy. So it didn't appear that there was any loot in the area. I didn't exactly have like a massively thorough look, but oh well. Go on, Axel. Off we go. Smart to stay here too long. You're the one holding us up. You know, if an alien was to show up behind us right now, you realize that you're bottlenecking me, right? Uh, Axel. Not helping, you, 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 not helping Just the point here. Stay alive, sweetheart. What's the Twitter got to say for itself? Your ship, huh? Yes, it is. Well, it's not my ship, but yeah. Quiet. I hear something. Axel, you may want to get me one. Woo! Yeah, I hear you. Will do. I know. I know. Meet the others. Something's going down. There's always something going down. Come on, we don't want to piss him off. You feel safe? I sure as hell <laughs> Follow me. <laughs> Alright. Sorry, I had to. Had to be done. 
Wait, I swear those guys are literally just over Oh, they are. They are, they are just over there. Hang on. I remember this. Let's be careful. Save! Right, what's, what's going on over there? If we go this way... Oh yeah, we were just here a minute ago. Wait, can't we just go this way? What? Can't we just go on there? Ooh. But I like the cookie. Don't shine that flashlight. Well, like this. It's like that! Run! Run! I think something just moved over there. It did! There's no way they've just let that happen. Turn up generator. Go, go, go. Hurry, 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 hurry. This thing. Go. 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 Anyone else see something new over there? No! Not me! Oh, I'm dead. God damn it. I didn't realise they'd be there. I thought they'd be uh, I thought they'd be on their way to the generator. I thought they would I thought they would have followed me to the generator. I didn't realise they would have just jumped straight at me like that. Alright. Okay. Okay. Um, I, I didn't, yeah, I didn't, I thought they would have followed me over to the generator, and then that would have, uh, snuck past. I didn't realise they would have literally just waited next to the... What's the emergency? Someone else has been here. Everyone, stay alert. Keep your guns tight. Shoot anyone you don't know. Stick around while I check our stock. Yeah. Cool. Sure. So, as we've just proven, Nightmare Mode does not make you restart the game. Sure. Off we go. Go over here. Activate this. Generator is off. Hi. Yeah, see, they do. No. Exactly. They they do go towards the generator. I was lied to. Right. Go. Off we go. Let's still close by. Yeah, Follow sure. Alright, let's go. We'll roll over here. We'll save again. Brilliant. Escape with Axel. You, well, uh, let's do that. Uh, same person who stole our stuff? Uh, no. Alright, off we go. I'm gonna go this way. Okay. It will be. Access terminal. Let's see what we've got. Svastalink. I'm not even supposed to be here. My shipping out papers were for a week ago. Okay, alright. A blind eye. S. I managed to get my hands on that stuff I was talking about. Chief won't even notice the stock missing. Things always get lost when a station's closing down. Don't worry about customs either. Sinclair's told his men to turn a blind eye. They'd probably be too busy goofing off or taking backhanders to notice anyway. You get what you pay for, I guess. Bailey. Commander Bailey, how dare you. Alright. Nope. Two-man rule. Nearson, Le uh, Nearson, Leonard, you are both first shift on the door, so read carefully. Putting this together wasn't easy, and we don't want intruders getting in because you didn't read the instructions properly. This here is what you call a two-man rule lock. This means it needs two to open the door simultaneously from two different consoles. Most of us don't know each other, so this is the safest way of making sure everything stays secure and none of us decide to head off on their own with our stuff. When you are on shift, it take, take it in turns to keep guard and notify the other if one of us needs to be let in or out. That means just us, no one else. No matter how much anyone begs and no matter what sob story they try and pull. I was with a group before and we got soft and now I'm the only one left. Trust no one. Joe. Alright, we have inventory. Uh, inventory. No one is to take anything or mark it off the list without talking to me first. Three exclamation marks. Uh, we have four aspirin, 32 canned food, six cereal boxes, four gallons of water, 12 tubes of toothpaste, uh, three cartons of cigarettes, uh, 26 uh, rolls of toilet paper, six rolls of industrial tape, two med kits, 52, uh, 52 cartons of powdered milk, and a cartridge in it. No, got a cartridge. God damn it, I messed up. I was going to say partridge in a pear tree, but oh well. Uh, notes, running low on ammunition. <laughs> Why did I mess that up? Oh, that was perfect, come on. Notes, running low on ammunition. Zoe managed to pick up some pre some, pre some prescription drugs, all addressed to the same person. Guess they didn't need them anymore. Alright. 
Brilliant. We've got compound B. Can I build? No, I can't. Nope, that's how you build that. Wait. Was that not what I... Oh. I've not, I got the thing. I got the one thing that I already had. God damn it. Where have we go? I kill ladies first. Baldies first? No? Okay, alright, fine. Ladies first it is. What have we got? You are not... What? What? It's powered down. The assholes have cut us off. Have they now? We did turn the generator off. Did you forget Look, that? We need to activate both consoles at the same time to open it. I'll do this one. You go to the one on the other side. Yeah, mate. You know okay. what? I would... I, oh, you read my mind. Yours is a pretty... Yours is a bit... Uh, yours is a bit easy to read because, you know, your shielding's down. But, oh well. Ready. On three. One, two, three. Got him. Anyway, why did the music play? Alright. Alright. Hit from behind, right? He's getting attacked. Come on, let's go. Run. There we go. Fuck you. Get here now. I've got the thieving son of a bitch. You uh, think you can take what you want? Bonk. Headshot. Fuck. Let's go. The others are on their way. Apparently, I don't believe they are, actually. Yes, they are. Off we go. This way. Run! Hey, I'm pulling the sprint button. Oh. Alright, there we go. Door's locked. We're fine. We're alive. Everybody move. Well, you know, I don't think that could have gone better. 30 FPS. You gotta love it. You killed that guy! Because he was going to kill me, you saved my life. You're welcome. This is about survival. Understand. Speaking of survival, I think there's a vent behind you, by the way. We should probably move. There we go. What the hell was that thing? I don't know. Maybe we should call it back and get a better look at it. Uh, Axel, can you hear me? Gotta keep moving. Uh, uh, Axel, you, you good? You, uh, okay. All right. Um, sure. For some reason, I was just thinking of Scary Movie Three when uh, it happened. Oh yeah. Um, this is the part where the alien can actually show up. It doesn't. Oh wait, hang on. No, oh, there you go. It doesn't actually show up until, like, the elevator gets here. And most, like, normally you would get in the elevator and then just run straight away because of this. You know, you like, uh, you know, the music starts kicking up. Like, we need this elevator to get here quickly before the alien shows up. In this elevator, hurry up! It's like you play this for the first time, you're like, come on, elevator, hurry up! The music keeps getting higher. Oh no. Wait. I think the here it is, elevator's on its way. Come on, open! Hurry up, open! Come on! I can, I can hear it, I can hear it in the vent. Can you actually hurry up, please? Alright, here we go. Go. Let me just sit here for a second. There it is. There, there, there it is. I don't you probably couldn't see that in the darkness, but it dropped down. There it was. It was it was stood in the door frame. Um Yeah. Ripley is a survivor and can use many things to evade danger. Now I don't believe the alien shows up again now for a, a little while. Find an elevator to seek some communications. Uh yeah, I don't believe the alien can be active, or, or I don't think the alien can show up and kill you now for a while. Ow. Ow. But, uh, yeah, let's see. So, if I do this now, doesn't, doesn't show up now? Alright. 
Access rewire. Let's see what we've got. Excuse me. I'm not going to read all that. Unstable system. Speak system. Yeah. Sure. Uh, I never use these much. I, I never used to use these much, so I don't know if, uh, if there's anything we can... Oh, well, I'll, well, I'll try and use those a bit more now and see if we can't get the taxes going a bit. It's like, uh... But if I try and like attract the alien to me, I don't think it can show up now. I go into the, yeah, I go into the vent now. It's not, it's not gonna be active now for a while. So uh, yeah, security, no oh, access to access to now. Yeah, we don't, ha we don't have that. So we're gonna, gonna be quick. We're gonna move on. Can we, right, this, this, this is inactive. There's nothing here. Off we go. Ooh, ooh. Okay, wait. Oh, oh yeah, we can search dead bodies. And we have a med kit, good stuff. Nice. Good stuff. I don't know. I don't think I have. Wait. I don't think I have a. No. Oh, there's no hood, is there? I just realized there's no hood because I'm on Nightmare, which means I don't know how much health I have. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God, that's going to complicate things, isn't it? Right. But we took some damage earlier, anyway, from when we, we, we fell, so I think we'll be fine using that. Uh, oh, yeah, I can't wait till we get the plasma torch. That'll make things interesting. Open up a load of it. Wait, hang on, we've got this thing. Grab you. Boop. We saw it. Map data unavailable. When are we going to unlock the goddamn map? I forget this. Alright. We can go in there. We can... Uh oh. Crouch. Right. Off she goes. Alright, okay, right, we gotta do this. We got we gotta be careful here. Oh yeah, no, I forget, they don't show up until you get this. Oh no. She was trying to hack the elevator security. Circuits are fried, easy fix. Alright. Just need to find a new data set. Okay. Okay. So these guys have got pistols and shotguns, and we need to take them out. Uh, flashlight batteries. Yeah, all right, let's get that. There they are. Nope! Ow. I wanted to get in that room before he got there. Oh god, they got me! Oh, ugh, okay, they came from behind. They, they, they got me. From, they got me from behind. I, damn it! I was gonna try and I was gonna try and knock him out and then get in that room, but damn it, everything went wrong in every possible way. All right, but let's try that again, but with a infinitely larger level of success. Right. That yeah, that, I can't believe that went wrong in so many ways. Like, there's only so many ways it should have gone wrong. I didn't make one mistake. I made two. <laughs> that got me shot three times. All right. Start again. Bloody mustache hair. Right. Right. Let me crouch. Please stop. All right. Go. Go. Run. Come on. Here we go. Thank you very much. Up we go. Keep, keep moving. We've got this thing. Ray, listen to me very carefully. I want you to leave work now. Collect Claire, pick up the cat, and head home. We need to find some place safe until Seeks and send a ship. I saw the guy from down the hall. I can't remember his name. The one in the dirty baseball cap and weird smell. He had something in his coat. I think it was a gun. He just looked right through me. Don't talk to anyone. Don't tell them where you're going. I will make no comment on the fact that you're bringing the cat with you. Cats are evil. Cats will kill you. Uh, unless it's a kitten. Kittens, kittens are adorable. Alright. Um, 
Yeah. Well, let's let's go. An access to her. She was trying to hack the elevators. Sure. Let's let's move on. Come on. Let's get going. Let's let's be quicker about this. Because uh, one of them's gonna come in here in a second. See anything yet? Keep it together. Oh. Right, it's one down. Realized two of them were down there. There was four of them. Right. So, uh, these guys know how to survive a horror movie. Literally stand perfectly still in a group looking at the place where you think there is a threat. I cannot kill these people. <laughs> um, right. <laughs> I could sneak all the way over there and progress but I want the loot <laughs> so I'm gonna do something stupid and somehow get their attention so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to get over here and then I'm going to sprint to the other side of the room hopefully that one of them hears me uh, n no it's not Diane well at least I go into the sound well not yet they're not Go, 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 go! They're run yes, they are. Oh my god. Oh god. Oh god. No. Oh god. No. No. God, please, no. Alright, there we go. Alright. Please don't, don't come. I'm, su I'm surprised by how... I'm surprised by how long I've... Oh, oh my god. They're actually regrouping and staying in position. One of them went up the stairs for a second. Oh no, never mind. No, no, they're splitting up. No, they're splitting. They're splitting up. But this time, it's actually strategically viable. God damn. It. Uh, 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 uh. I'm gonna go this way. I'm gonna wait for him. <laughs> I thought what they'd done is that they'd they'd one of them. Had... Okay, that's that's me. All right. I thought that what what they had done is one of them had gone upstairs to see where I went, and then once I'd gone out of view, they went back in a group again. I was like, uh, damn, that didn't work. But okay. So I'm gonna chill here. One of them is going to walk up there, I'm going to kill him, and I'm going to run back here. Where? He should be here by now. Which, he's not here. Which means that in order to find out where he is, I'm going to have to leave my handing spot. Wait. Sounds like a good plan.
Nope. He's turning around again. I don't know where his mates are. His, I know his mates are going to be right in the corner. If I, don't turn around. His, his mate. I knew it. His mates just walked through the door. Oh no. They're talking about the dead body. They're not talking about me. Okay. Oh, that's even worse. Because that just means they're all going to regroup right up there. Damn it. This has all gone wrong. Yes, you are. Split up. Look, this is what this is what they all do in the horror movies. They split up. Do that. It always works for them. Cough, cough. <laughs> You've scared them off. I'm calling it. I don't know if you scared them off, but you've done something. Every instinct I have is telling me to not peek. <laughs> My muscles are telling me to peek. Like, my fingers are on... <coughs> are you in the game? Is that what's happening right there? Anyway. Nope, I'm going. Screw it, I don't need the loop. I don't need the loop. One of them's just missed me. One of them's just missed me. Oh my goodness. It's like, I think she went no, 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 I did not go downstairs. 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 I went straight forward. And the alien's right there. Hang on, I forgot them. The alien's right there as well. Good stuff. Yeah, sorry, my bad. That was me. All right. Um, anyway, so, um, yeah, like, my fingers were on the buttons to peek, but I was like, don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Do you know when you, um, <laughs> It's like, my, it's, um, my, my, finger, my, my fingers were arranged on the controllers to peek, and I wanted to peek, but I was like, don't do it. I can, I can, se I've got a sixth sense, they're right there, I can tell. And then all, all they hear is, is coughing, and I'm like, oh god. And then the guy just walks around the corner, I'm like, oh dear. Let's go. We have a revolver. Now we're evening the odds. Revolver corrected. C corrected? Collected. Okay, alright. Yes, Nightmare Difficulty really does do a thing. Right. Take one step backwards. There we go. I just heard a door open, a door open behind me. Okay. Right. I'm 99.99999999% sure that I'm not the only person who, who mistakes that for a person every time they walk through this door. All right. Don't be an alien. Don't be an alien. All right, cool. Keycard required. Wait, the keycard's here, isn't it? Hmm. Here we go. Low power. No. Nope. Where are you? Here it is. Boom. Got it. Wait. Save. Got it. All righty then. What have we got? Go forward. Let's run. It's not like the alien's going to show up and just abduct me through the vent now, is it? What? Could have sworn I saw something move at the other end there, but oh well. Alrighty then. So, oh, we've got an ID tag. Sure, why not? Good to know. Excuse me? What have we got? Oh, dear. That's pleasant. Device invalid, if you say so. Ah, yes. Now, this is a man with injuries. He's been shot several times and then shot in the head. SCI injector. Alright. This is, uh... This is, this is how they up the ante in John Wick 4, you know? The, doc the, the, doc the doctor helps him again. And he, uh... He, he, he needs him to shoot him several more times in a chair. But then this time he just says, Ah, screw this, and just kills him. Um... Blueprint oh, collected. There you go. Right, we've got smoke bomb. Hell yeah. I, I probably won't be using any of these, but oh well. I mean, maybe on Nightmare Difficulty, I actually will have to mess around with some different stuff. Right, we've got this. N Nightmare Difficulty. There are, there's like nothing in any of these. Superficial injuries, I think. Yes. Those ones. 
Oh, there we go. It's it's corrupted. Oh my god. Oh my god, files corrupted. The bane of every YouTuber. First time. Anyway. Stay focused. Oh. Security lockdown. Initiated. Right. Right, let's get you going. Let's get... Oh no, blaring lights and noises. That's not what I want to be hearing when I'm trying to avoid a, a, a the perfect hunter. Right, here we go. We've got you. That's going to allow us to get out. Nice. I don't know if the alien can actually get in here. The alien can get in here because there's the vent. Sick. Let me walk underneath it like a bloody melon. Right, what we look forward to now. Right, I can hear the alien. Right. Boom, done. We got it, we're sorted. Alright. Ooh, I been. I think I partially remember what happens. I need to be very, very careful because, as much as the oh the oh no the alien actually is active now. I remember, the alien actually is active now. If we if we make noise now, the alien shows up. I think. Oh no, not yet, not yet, but it will do in a second. Disable the security lockdown. Oh yes. See if I run now, does it show up? Probably don't want to test that considering I haven't saved. So hang on, let me not. But that being in mind, I probably should have saved when I walked past the save station a second ago. But oh well. Oh god. Oh wait, no, I got it. Good stuff. All right. What have we got? Oh, blaring alarms and the perfect hunter, as well as two vengeful survivors after me. I thought I heard something behind me just now. Access terminal, why not? We shall be accessing all of the terminals, because why not? Don't mention anything about Perfect Hunter. Um, archives to W Chief Porter. Reply Sevastopol Station, uh, Sevastopol Terminals. Chief, the good news is that I'm about 80% through archiving Sevastopol's internal mail system for the decommissioning. It's been disconnected from Apollo, but I've left the basic messaging system in place for the people still here. The bad news is whoever set it up in the first place skimped on the hardware and we've had some leaks. I've got Mike Tanaka looking into it now. He's a specialist archivist we called in. He uh, seems to know his shit. Just thought I'd better give you the heads up in the meantime. Alright, we've got Shared. An Outpost of Progress, number one. Sevastopol, an Outpost of Progress, by Julia Jones. Desolation through isolation. Hey, that's the name of the game! The space station that nobody needed, run by a company we all forgot. Sevastopol is now a backwater. The population is a tenth of the station's optimal capacity, docking bays are empty and the shutters are down on local stores and businesses. The orders for Seekson's cheaply manufactured androids have long since dried up. Uh, and uh, have long since dried up and the antiquated Apollo governing AI system frequently malfunctions. Oh dear. How did we get here and more how did we get here? And more importantly, where have billions of dollars of investment gone? My name is Julia Jones. I have lived on Sevastopol for two months, compiling this report for the Colonial Times, discovering the price our second-tier corporations have paid for their overexpansion during the race into the Outer Rim. Alrighty then, we have audio, and there is nothing. Utility, and there is nothing. Good to know. Let's have a look about. Uh, we're gonna get all the loot possible while the alien is not active. At least I think it's not active, because in a minute, it's about to be active, and there is no doubt about that. Let's go. All right, so. All right, you will, oh, disable the security lockdown. Let's do it. Enter. Enter, enter, enter. Run. Oh, don't run. That gets you killed. I'm not here. Stop making noise. Hold your damn coffin.
they went that way. That's a cute alien here. Um, you're welcome to go try your luck, Chief. Just saying. I... I, I, I hear it's a great kisser, if you want to give that a go. <laughs> anyway, uh, off we go. Uh, let's, right. Do I run for the elevator? No. <laughs> off we go. Let's see what's going on here. Oh, we can't, can't we? Like, the elevator's not active. This one's not active, I don't think. Let me check, I'll check it real quick, but I don't think it is active. <laughs> My hands off, yeah. Uh, here we go. Right, so yeah, that that that, that uh, elevator is in fact inactive. I can go in there, but I shall not. Uh, we, oh wait, I want to go in here and I want to save. Alright, and now we need to be careful of vents, because this thing can crawl through vents. Obviously. And, uh... Oh dear! Save. Good to know. Yeah, mate. Now if I run... If I... wait. Do you know when you're not sure if you hear something? That's what this game does to you. You don't get used to it. I'm not sure if it's active yet. Or if it actually responds to, like, noise cues. What Alien Isolation does to you is you never know if it's been long enough to think, right, it's not here. You never th you never know it's been long enough. You're like, wait, shall I wait longer? And then you want to leave and you think, wait, just a bit longer. It's like, just be absolutely sure. You're like, right, I can't hear anything. I'll stay in here a bit longer. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, it's a, it's, oh, it's a good game. Alright. I'm gonna run like a melon. And it's not gonna find me. Because the alien don't like melons. Do you reckon the aliens like melons? No, true, true. Yeah, do, do, do you reckon aliens like melons? Like, if you if you fed a melon to it, would it actually, like, like not care? Or, like... There we go. Yeah, it doesn't appear that the alien's active at the moment. But if we go through here... Whoa, 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 whoa. Yep, done. Alright. Uh-oh. Wait, 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 I want to see, I want to see. Okay, that was weird. Uh, probably won't eat it, maybe like meat better. I should probably move because it can definitely see me from there. It can definitely, it, it could definitely see me from there. It can definitely see me from there. It def no, oh god, it wasn't me! Damn it! I was. Gonna oh, what the audio broke? Oh, what was that? The audio glitch. God damn it! Um, yeah, I was gonna say the alien could definitely see me from there, so I was like, I should probably move. <laughs> but I, I, I don't know. I, I stood and walked for too long. Right. Um. So, what am I doing now? What was I... What was I, in, I feel like I was in the middle of saying something. I can't remember. Alright. But that is why you save all the time. Right. Uh, I do kind of want to see, though. If I stand where the alien... No. If I stand where the alien can see me, can I get it to lose, like, track of me? Without... Uh, like, if I find a hiding spot or something. Can I get it to lose where I am? If it, if it sees me and goes to the place where it spot me, in this section, without the flamethrower, without anything like that, can I get it, to, can I lose its attention? I want to see if I can't do it. Alright. Alright, so it's, it's definitely, okay, alright, so it's definitely, right, so it's definitely seen me, it's definitely seen me, it knows I'm here. Okay, there we go. It's running up to me. It's right outside.
It's right out. It's like right there. It's coming. No, it's not. It's coming through the door. Shit. <laughs> there we go. Brilliant. At least the audio. At least the audio. At least the audio didn't cut there. I'm sorry. That's gonna get clips. I'm clipping that. Okay. Hang on. Let me let me let me clip this. Hang on. Right. That's it. Pause. Sorry. There we go. I said it's just it was just the fact that I saw it. Hang on. It's right out. It's no, like right on. there. Stop. Stop. Right. Cause that's. Hang on. Nice. So if I do this. <sighs> Sometimes it just do be like that. Sure. Why not? It works. Boom. Nice. All right. Let's get up there now. Let's actually, let's actually hide. Let's like... We'll, we'll, we'll actually try and we'll actually like try and get through that door and progress. So there's nothing down there, I don't believe. No, no loot, nothing for us. Hey, ladies, there's nothing down there. Why are you going down the street that way? Right. Yep. I always like those mini games as well. Those are fun. All right. Maybe like meat better. Well, you know, it appears to have a preference. Alright, nice. So if I crouch like this, it's not gonna know I'm here. I'm gonna go over here to the stairs. Oh. You see? No. It's going that way. And it's gone. Probably shouldn't be running. It definitely hurt me. It it definitely didn't hear me. Don't know what you mean. How could it have hurt me? Go. Now. <laughs> Not waiting to find out. <laughs> Brilliant. Alright, off we go. Sprinting is a last resort. It is loud and alerts anything nearby that could hear you. You know, I feel like we should test that theory. I think there's a couple of, uh, I think, I think there's a citation needed. <laughs> right, here we go. Oh my god, it's a working Joe. Excuse me. Hello, my name's Ripley, Amanda Ripley. I need your help. Please take a seat. Someone will be with you shortly. No wonder Seeksim is losing the tech race. Yeah. Sir? Sir? I, d I, d I don't. Okay. All right, off we go. So yeah, we have to we have to watch out for vents now. That's that's always fun. Wait, if I run, does the alien give a shit? Does it care? I don't know. Let's go. Key card required. Okay. All right. It would, it would appear not. Oh god, the the the, the seeks and synthetics are all over the place. Oh god, no. All right. What's this thing? Uh, key card. Yep. Can I help you? I need to get into comms control. It's urgent. That is a restricted area. It's an emergency. Don't you realize what's going on? Apollo has the situation in hand. Your registration is almost complete. Forget it. I'll find my own way in. I will do that. Don't say it. Don't you say it. it. <gasps> oh my goodness, you son of a bitch! All right. There we go. Oh, this is where we get the, the thing that, that tells us when we're dead. There we go. Some kind of tracker. It's been modified. Yes, it's been modified to be the sixth sense for death. Like, look at that. Oh my god, there's something behind me. Is there a problem? No. The mechanical no kind. Alright. Sure. Uh, collect scrap. Yep. Uh, access to access terminal. We have access to rewire. Yep, mate. 
I feel like these seeks and synthetics are in need of a bit of a rewire. Air purification. Your lighting. Relay access. Air purification. S turn them off, I suppose. I don't really know what that's supposed to do, but uh, sure. Access terminal. Boom. Excuse me, what have we got? Door override. Hughes, I put a manual lock on the door leading upstairs. Don't want any accidents until we figure out what's going on here. Uh, Chief. Alright, we have error. A file system corrupted. Shared. Our manifesto. First published in Ion, Ion Seekson, February 2115. Or I guess you could say 2115. That, that, was a, that was a reference to the 115 song. It was pretty pointless and dad. We don't want to show you a new world. We want to discover it with you. Here at Seekson, every new technology, research project, and discovery is driven to find real-world applications to help you. We hope you'll join us for the journey. I will love nothing better to jettison the person who wrote that into the gas giant. Let's go. Together, tomorrow, together, issue one. Together, tomorrow, Seekson's journey into colonial space and official history by Sebastian Sieg, first printed in Ion Seekson. Our origins in space. 2034 changed everything. The advent of faster than light travel put Seekson, then known as Sieg and Sun, on the path to success. The race into space began in earnest, and under the steady hand of our founder, Josiah Sieg, the company, the company was primed and ready for the years that followed. Sieg and Sun built the components that enabled ships to extend colonial space beyond the solar system. As history relates, Wayland Corp was reluctant to share its FTL technologies with other corporations. Fortunately, Josiah Sieg was on, ha was on hand to speculate, innovate, and produce. Without Sieg and Sun, the skies would have looked very different indeed. Very well, so uh, yeah, I don't know much about the alien history and lore. Aliens is pretty much where I stop. Audio, please understand. Okay, do all right. Well, I hope you made it, Chief. Door access, override door mechanism. Yeah, let's do it. And now we can go this way. Sure, let's go this way. I feel like there's probably more loot. Oh, I, well, this thing's just beeped at me, which means something bad is probably about to happen. All right, let me save just in case something bad's about to happen. Then we'll sort ourselves out. Yeah, mate. Boom. Good stuff. Yeah, I want to try and get into daily streams, but I don't, uh, I've been, I've been, I've been struggling to keep up with the YouTube uploads, the, the two a day, and balance that, but we'll, I'll figure, I'll figure it out. I just need to get better at doing everything, I just need to get, uh, more efficient, uh, I just need to, like, get more efficient at refining that process, and then, hopefully it should be maintainable. Like, I've missed today's upload, but I can get, I've, I've got enough recorded, and pre, uh, and rendered, that I, uh, I can upload, I, I can catch up on the missed upload today, Upload three tomorrow, and then I should have enough to upload, uh, and then I'll be able to get everything uh, edited and rendered and uploaded tomorrow uh, in time for me to do bulk recording, bulk rendering, and then hopefully I should still be able to do the stream, and then that, that will then, I will then have videos prepped, uh, prepped for tomorrow and the day after. So hopefully, hopefully with a bit of, okay, alright, hopefully with a bit of, uh, refine the process a little bit and get a bit more efficient at it. It'll be sustainable, and we can do daily streams. I, 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 I don't, I don't want to like stop streaming, you know. I want to, I want to, I, I want to be able to do both. Anyway, let's go. Oh my goodness, look at that! Someone's belongings. Come on, that seems quite overwhelming. What, what? Two videos a day and a daily stream? I mean, it's, it, it, it's not. Um, I, I wouldn't be, I wouldn't be surprised. It's probably un healthily sustainable it's not something i would advise but i mean you know i wouldn't if you okay that's um there you go i'll be happy I, I'm, ha I'm happy to do it i want to get because the thing is is that um I, I like my streams but youtube is what i prefer so but there's so many games that i want to play but that means i have to get through games that i'm already playing and i don't want i don't want to slow down with them i don't i don't, don't want to slow down with them right i need to i need to avoid the vents now i need to start doing that um Right, there we go. Then I'm in the right place. Uh, well, actually, I need to contact my ship. 
Let me in. What else in? There's gotta be another way inside. Well then, my gamer instincts are telling me to go this way. I, I'm running under the. I'm, I love you. Love what you do. I do indeed. Thank you, Chief. Um. So off we go. I should probably not just dive headfirst into a vent. I, I was, I've been running into vents deliberately at this point. Um, we need to start not doing that. Oh. Don't you recognize me? I recognize your name. We've got to reestablish long-range communications. You're becoming hysterical. Get back! I'm warning you. Tut, tut. This is all this Call him a nice, call him a nice synthetic. Call him a good synthetic. It works, trust me. It works, Chief. No, call him a good synthetic. Quick, quick. Oh. Well, you know, he uh, he was not a pro gamer. He didn't call him a good android. He uh, he was anti he was anti AI, and it 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 bit him in the ass. Here we go. Right, stay away from that thing. Okay, gain access to the elevator, avoid detection. All right, hang on. So I want this guy's loot, and then I want to go in there and, and I, I want I want to see if I can like, kill this android. It's just in there. It's just chilling. Here we go. Uh, personal, your logged message. Uh, sensitive corporate uh, sensitive corporate information has been automatically detected in a Sebastian Link message recently sent from this terminal. This event has been logged by Apollo on behalf of Seeksim. If you have any further questions, please talk to your line manager or your nearest synthetic Seeksim re uh, re representative. I will be talking to one indeed, good sir. Shared, Apollo's eye. Riggs, are you still working down in Seeksim communications? Remember that trouble you got into last year? The trouble I helped you out of? Well, it's time to repay the favour. One of my colleagues has been looking into some of the import documents and found a few problems. He's new, so he doesn't understand how we do things on Sebastopol, and he's threatening to go to wait about it. This could hurt us all, so I need you to keep an eye on him. See if anything interesting comes up. Apollo has cameras everywhere. It just needs someone to tell it where to point to. His name is Daniel Halden. Daniel Halden lives in Josiah, Josiah Sig Executive Apartments 651. If things go, if this goes well, I might have some more work for you. We could clean up here. Ransom. All right, so we need to keep an eye out for a guy called Ransom because he's a bit dodgy. All right, there's an android behind me. I'm gonna sort him out. How, how many headshots does this guy take? If I, if I remember, the way you preserve your. Wait. <laughs> there's two of you. No. Don't know what you mean. Don't know what you mean. Don't know what you mean. How much ammo do I have? All right, hang on. So. Oh, that missed! Oh god, no, that missed. Alright, come on. Oh, nope. This didn't work. Oh god. Finish streaming. Oh, Harry, how you doing? Come on. Oh, never mind. Oh, wow, these guys do a lot of damage. Never mind. They, uh, they, oh. They uh they, yeah they 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 uh they do they do a lot of damage they uh the alien has heightened senses yeah okay you really can't afford to do much with these guys no oh wait no wait I'm here hang on oh no okay I do have this right, hang on let me go here get this let me see what we've got so yeah mate sure let's go in here let's try it again. I'll access the terminal, but I don't believe I need it, so... Wait. Where am I going right now? Okay, the marker on the edge that supports your objective. Yep. Noise maker. Oh, yes, I need that. <coughs> yeah, that's me. That's a good sir. Uh, still a good uh, TR trainer. Oh, trainer. Uh, oh, still a good trainer than I am. Still a better trainer than I am wizards. Uh, you'll get that, chief. Um, I, 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 are you winning, son? Is that is, is that is that what's happening there? Right, let me see if I can't build. First off, I need to build a med kit. Yep. Good. And then... Oh, I only have seven revolver rounds. Wow, okay. Noise maker. Nope. Smoke bombs. 
Uh, sure. Get you. Yep. Brilliant. Cool. Good stuff. I've won every battle so wizard. I've won every battle so far. Well, then you're winning, aren't you? All right. Let's go. I'm going to save again so I don't have to get all that. Okay. Well, apparently not, so... Oh, well. Uh, let's go. And let's do this with a bit more success. Success being... Not death. Wait. Hey, we'll go... Wait, am I going this way? I feel like I'm being a melon. Am I supposed to go this way? I, f I feel like there was an... A I feel like the alien was under one of the, uh... Vents just then, because... The music kicked up as I walked past the vent. Do not go underneath that. Have I, sp have I supposed to... Have I... I've, I've gone all the way back, haven't I? Was I not supposed to go all the way... Right, hang on, hang on. Let me go all the way back. I've been a bloody melon. I've gone all the way back when I'm not supposed to. Righty then. So. It's just these guys that I can hear, isn't it? Stay away from the vents. Oh dear. Harry, have you played Alien Isolation? Hath you engaged in the isolation of aliens? Alright, we go. Go on here. Make our way in this direction. Aha! Uh -huh. Oh god, I've got to get these again! Alright, come on. Get started. I'll come back and get those. Got it. Yeah, mate. Light Resident Evil 4, not very far. You do that a lot, don't you? You, you got a knack for that. This guy's got a knack for playing good games, like the first chapter, and then he goes... Here we go. Right. There we go. Come on. So we can go this way, and um, we shall go this way. Um, let, let me guess. You're waiting until you, until you play the Resident Evil remake. You're waiting to play the remake. Huh? You, you, you'll play the remake, won't you? It's me, Hughes. Don't you recognize me? All right. Listen to me. Can I just get this? We've got to reestablish long-range communications. You're becoming hysterical. Get back! I'm warning you. Good day. Yeah, the the uh. Well, I just remembered why I stopped playing Resident Evil 4 because I just hated the controls so much. No, you have to get used to them, mate. The controls aren't actually the controls aren't actually bad. You just have to learn to work with them. Um, so it's I, I know what you mean, all right? But you got you 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 learn like enemy. Once you learn like how enemies move, you learn to you learn to move around them using the the uh, the movement system that that's there. Um, like for example, being able to uh, if, you, if, you, if you like take a step forward towards an enemy usually they, they will go for an attack and you walk backwards don't 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 hold the a button like the, the a button is not your life your life or the X the sprint button it's not it's not your lifeline um, right, we'll access this uh, yeah once you uh, well, you've played for a bit long it's like, it's like Leon is a car and you move back like reversing a car yeah 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 um, I, I, know, I know what you mean but if you, you you get you get used to it. Uh, you'll you'll learn to make it work for you. Um, work 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 to your benefit. Um, it's it's a really fun game, mate. Once you get into it. Uh, and bearing in mind, the game did come out in like two thousand four. When did it actually come out? Hang on. Uh, so first off, let's have a look. Uh, Resident Evil Four release date. When it when did it come out? Yeah, 11th of January, 2005. It, that was when it originally came out. Like, oh my goodness, it's been a long time. I got as far as the giant again. You got as far as the giant? You should have gone into it by that point. Um. Yeah, I, I would have thought that you'd gone into it by that point. Uh, oh, sorry to hear that, man. But, um. But yeah, oh, mate, I remember. I remember watching my brother fight that. Uh. Like, late at night when I'm supposed to be asleep. No, it does not. 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 It just. Oh, this does not require your attention. It requires the opposite of your attention because I'm going this way. Go, 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 go. 
go, 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 Off we go. No, no, no. Bye, have a great time. Good stuff. There we go. Now we're getting somewhere. I'm dead. Okay. Um, that's all well and good. I think now is good enough time to end it. That's all the time I've got for today. I hope you guys had about as much fun as I did. If there are any games you'd like to see me play, feel free to suggest them down in the comments. And I'll see you guys in the next one. And have a splendid day. But before we leave, we are going to raid someone. So. Let's have a look. Raid channel. Who's live? We've got... Uh, we've got Heartbreak Hotel. Sure, let's go. Start raid. Why not? Playing Valorant. Yeah, mate. There we go. Nah, that's the one. Five, four, three, two, one. Thunderbirds, I go. Bye!